wow, wow, wow. Which bit's the toasted bit? Yeah, I, I never rec have recommended the ravioli. I mean, they're raw. Yeah, a lot of people don't like that. They're either really raw or they're just like cardboard. She doesn't know what she's talking about. I mean, they're dangerous. Does she eat them? Tatiana, does she eat that dish? No. No, will you ask her to taste one for me? Okay. And then I think she'll 86 them. All right. Toasted ravioli, really? Yeah, sounds like the owners are toast. He said taste it and agree with him and 86 it. I can't take food back there. None of us can take food back there. That's not how it's supposed to go. You're supposed to go straight to the chef and say, this is wrong. Wow. This is the fruit de mare. Fruit de mare. Yes. Wow. It's a bizarre looking fruit de mare. OK, great. Thank you, my darling. Mm -hmm. Pasta's mush. Way of a cook. Oh my god. Strands of mozzarella. Is that mozzarella on top of that? Yes, it is. It's on a fruit de mare. And then the pasta. It's just mush. It's almost like it's canned. And um, the mussels taste uh, like old stout. Are they fresh mussels? I don't no. think so. And the shrimps. These ones are way overcooked. And Those these ones are grey. Strange. Yeah. This has been going on for like a month or two now. He's just been sitting on bad shrimp, and we don't know why. Genevieve doesn't shut up. And do you not tell the chef? Well, I can't take complaints to the chef. Seriously? Um, Tatiana doesn't really listen to any of us. <laughs> wow, not good. What the hell is that? What it's is the that? lasagna. That's the lasagna? The lasagna is vile. It's embarrassing to serve that to Chef Ramsay. What's in the sauce? Why is it that color? It's pink sauce. She doesn't know what's in it. Pink sauce with lasagna. Is it his own recipe? Yes, it is. The sauce tastes bizarre. And the um, mouthful I had was um, stone cold. It's hot one side, cold the other. Is that microwaved? It might be. Don't, don't answer a question you don't know. Oh. Wow. Right. Um, is there a problem with these microwaves? Not that I'm aware no. of. It feels like the microwave's on the blink. Yes, it is. Wow. When a restaurant can't get food microwaved properly, by an all-time low. Let me answer these questions. Still, there's always hope for the pizza. Can you look at another like that? All right, maybe we can win them over with the pizza. It's crispy, isn't it? No. It's oh, como bien. It's not pizza. It's si, pero no es como menos cocido. What's it? Oh, here's my pizza. Now this the garlic chicken. Oh, God, I hope he likes something. Oof. Doughy. So bready, so doughy, and got all this raw pastry underneath there. Oh, no, he doesn't like the pizza. It resembles nothing homemade. Oh, my God. They've got a pizza that's come out of the oven. That feels like something that's been frozen. He hates our pizza. He hates our pizza. What a shame. <laughs> oh, dear. Is it, is it that bad, Chef? Uh, yeah, it's not funny. Uh, I don't know what the giggles and the laughing is about, but the dishes have been dreadful. OK. I'm trying not to cry, but he's going to come after me. I can feel it. And you, the menu's huge, right? The menu is huge. The last I counted, there was 126 things on there. <sighs> OK, great. Right, let's start off with. Oh, fried ravioli. Love them. OK. Do you know what? What about the linguine escatori? OK. What is the catch of the day? That's uh, mahi mahi. Let's do that. Absolutely. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm. Decor's hideous. It's stuck in a time warp. Takes me back to 1981. OK, I have a fried ravioli for Chef Ramsay. Fried ravioli for the chef. My food is the best food that's possibly made. But the problem with the restaurant is that we're fighting so much. Fried ravioli. OK. The fried ravioli. What's inside the ravioli, please? Uh, it's a five cheese stuffed ravioli. And the five cheeses are? Uh, I'm not sure. Well. Wow. It's a pre-made ravioli. So not homemade? The, those are not homemade. If we don't even make them here, it'd be nice to know what's inside them. I'll find out right now for you. Thank you. How's it going? I need to find out what cheeses are in the ravioli. What cheeses are in the ravioli? Yeah. yeah. What kind of cheese is in the bread of ravioli? Read the box. It's a ricotta cheese, Joe. It's a ricotta cheese. 
Oh my god. Ah, horrible. That's something deep, fried, frozen. It doesn't even taste like cheese. Jesus, no. You got a whole uh, whey and you got American grana. And uh, a skim cheese. Yeah. Okay, perfect. You got it? Thank you, yes. Yeah, not good. Franzi, I checked on the cheeses for you. Uh, mascarpone. Mascarpone. Ricotta. Ricotta. Uh, also, uh, American Garana, something called a uh, cheese whey and culture blend. Where the fuck is that from in Italy? I don't. I have no idea where that's from. Ooh. And a uh, skimmed cheese. Skimmed cheese in a fried ravioli. What does that mean? It's fat-free cheese dipped in fat. Dipped in fat, yeah. Tamale, I'm extremely hot. Right. God, I hope the tamales are moist. Jesus. It's like soaking wet newspaper. Gee. That is so dry. What you say? My goodness me. That's a fresh tamale. Well, when we make them, we make them in big batches, and then they're steamed, and then they're served, because we make such large volumes at a time. So you're sounding like the catering company now? Yes. And they go out like that? It's, they should be wet enough with the sauce inside that when you re-steam them, they stay moist. What an embarrassment. And this is your chef that ran a catering business? Correct. Jesus. OK. OK. Hates the tamales. Really? Perla hates them. He said it's so dry, it's inedible. He said it's embarrassing. Yeah, very dry. Are you cooking everything? Yeah. Charlotte, are you cooking the chimis? Uh-huh. I use the microwave for chimichangas for one minute before they fry. They taste really, really, really good. OK, chicken chimichangas. Ooh. Chimmy, 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 changa. It's dry. It's shards of dry chicken. God, now what? Here's the thing, honestly. Jimmy Changa, Jimmy chuck it in the bin. What a shame. Perla, he hates the chimmies. He didn't like them. I taste before. It's really good, the flavor. Not to him, apparently. I'm frustrated at my kitchen. It's a bit of a punch to the gut about my food. Steak burrito. Look at that. That is gross. That has to be the biggest ad for any diaper anywhere in California. Oh, no. Oh, God. My God. Jesus. That's like eating wet cardboard. Have a taste of that, please. Bloody hell. The steak was gamey. It was kind of like a car wash, moist and mushy. Oh, my God. That is disgusting. He tastes the steak. He says the steak tastes like shit. Did you grill him fresh steak for his burrito? Yeah. You didn't pull it from here, right? <laughs> didn't we taste everything before we put it yeah. out? <laughs> it's really salty. Nobody tasted before we did this? There's the sign, but grill 303. What the fuck is that? Maybe I'm too late. Grill. Yes, the sunrise. Oh dear, oh dear. How are you? Very well indeed, thank you. Grill 303 or not a fiesta? Fiesta, fiesta sunrise. Okay, good. Fiesta sunrise. Nice to see you. Nice to meet you. I thought it was too late. I thought it was the new restaurant already. Oh well, we don't change the the little logo in the front. You haven't changed the logo on the front. No. And it's been like that for how long? Or a year and a half. A year and a half. Yeah. Okay. Right. Jesus, what's that? This is a new uh, favorite of margarita we have in here. So it's complimentary? Complimentary, exactly. Wow. Yeah. So you don't have to pay for drinks, you just come up here and. Well, help you yourself. know, when the people they come in, we try to be, you know, mm -hmm. give us something to appetize her to start. Mm. It's too strong. Mm. Leo? Mm. Tequila? Mm. Right, let's put some warmth on my balls. Okay. Yes. Should we sit down? Please. Excellent. Come. So that's free. 
nice. Wow, look at the size of this place. So how many seats have you got there? 120. 120? 120, yeah. Uh -huh. Wow. How many's booked for lunch? Two tables. OK, what would you recommend? The combination number one. Number one combination? One, one taco, you have one taco, one burrito, and one enchilada. OK. Yeah, I'll try one of the fajitas as well. OK. I'm hoping that Chef Ramsey kicks week is bad. What is that on there? Looks like I've got a sticker on my menu. Just trying to peel it off, and it's bugging me. Ah. The art of Mexican cooking. What is that under there? The name of the... What name is that? It was uh, my another restaurant that, that I used to have. Fiesta Garibaldi. Fiesta Garibaldi? Yes. So you brought the old menus from the old restaurant into the new restaurant and stuck some sellotape on there? Exactly. Yes. And is that restaurant still open? No, we closed. And you called it Fiesta Sunrise as opposed to Fiesta Garibaldi? Correct, yes. Uh, I'm really confused for you. Same chef? Same chef. Same ingredients? Same ingredients. You brought the ingredients from the old restaurant into this restaurant? Oh, well, you know, different. We buy in fresh, you, you, but, but you the same. Fresh same ingredients? Menu. Yes, correct. Ooh, bloody hell. That. Have you got a bin? Yes, chef. The moves? Just by the front door. Huh? I, it's by the door. No. We just had the exterminator. You, you paid for the exterminator? Sure. Get your money back. OK, that's not funny. I've got an incinerator outside. Can you take that? No? As a general manager, do something with it. The mouse. The mouse? It was in the entrance as I walked in on a the left-hand side. Mouse? A mouse? mouse? We always have the exterminator once a month for prevention. Are you serious? No fucking work. A uh, mouse? Come on. Here. At the front door, I'm not even in the kitchen. Hey, guys, be careful of mice. Can you show me where you found that at? It was at the front door. Like where? Oh, well, where's the front door in your mind? I can't believe that. I came in the door, walked in there, saw him, bang, right there. Right here. Do you have it on film? Are you kidding me? What, you thought I brought it in out of my pocket? Yeah, I think you did. Are you? Are you, are you fucking dreaming? I arrived, the never, mouse was there. Never, never, never here, never. There was no, no, never no mouse right here. Right, OK. Absurd. So we had the exterminator last week. They come on regular occasions. Yes. We yeah. have an issue with mice. That's why you have an exterminator. We, we don't have an issue with mice. An exterminator comes in okay. regularly. Just... Let's, let's, you know, I do a little investigation. Let's go. Dwayne, when was the last time you spotted a mouse in here? I, I've never seen one. You've never seen one? No. Good. Except that one that was under the steam table that was dead a few months back. <laughs> Almost a year back. He found a mouse in the front door. I've never been so embarrassed and humiliated in my life. This is ridiculous. Really ridiculous. And sad. I've never seen a mice in here. Perhaps you planted that uh, mouse. And you are suggesting that I brought it in? I was like, hmm, I put it together, like, just for TV sake, maybe. I, I wish you would talk a little bit of sense. Fuck the TV. Put Please. your money where your mouth is, in front of your staff. I want a meeting upstairs with you and everybody now. Yes. Mice out of his pockets and stuff. You gotta take some responsibility for something, man. How you gonna help us if everybody keep bullshitting, man? A mouse in the front door. It it's, it's, it's mice infested all over this place. It can happen. It can happen. Look at James for me. Two seconds. I walked in the front door. A mouse. The mouse that you planted. I know. They told me, but it's okay. No, it's not it's okay. A show. It's got nothing to do with TV, nothing to do with your business in the shit. I am not going to stand there and even attempt to take that crap from you. You can take your restaurant and stick it. I'm gone. I'm out of here. You out of here. I'm out of here. Excuse me. Go. Okay. See you later. That 
It's salmon. That's just marinated in... It's like an Italian dressing. Oh, dear. What's this? Oh. Seafood restaurant on the water. Tuna and dyed pink to make it look authentic. Look at it. My god. Unbelievable. And here we have... That looks like the mushroom risotto. Great risotto. Unbelievable. Alarmed by the state of the kitchen, Gordon is anxious to take the staff on a tour. Good morning. There's something I want to show you guys, yeah? Come with me. Come in. The general hygiene of this fridge is a fucking joke. All right, come round. Walking round, want to get up to speed, looking at the ingredients, checking. What is that? Is that just taken from the steam table and dumped on the trolley and then whisked yes, in here? That's exactly what it is. That should be straight in the trash. Hey, I ate here yesterday. Yeah. I'm not happy. Whoever's responsible, 40 years in the business, well experienced, you have to seriously start opening your eyes. This place is not right here. We've got no chance. I did not know that was going on. Item after item. Oh, I was pissed. What's this here? I um, believe it's beef tips. Beef bits in blood. That's nasty. I need some answers, AJ. It's pretty terrible, and uh, you know, a lot of it lies on AJ. There's no excuse for it. And that's the that's the classic of the day. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a risotto. Take a good look. Unfortunately, it's not a drawing. That's real serious shit at its best. It's a joke. Look at the fucking color of the chicken. AJ, come have a look right. at it. Yeah, no, okay. you've got to see it, AJ. I do see it. My father doesn't want to deal with the back of the house. The back of the house is falling apart. That's my frustration. I'm sorry, but it's not right. It's got to be somebody's responsibility. I'm not going to take responsibility. It's the owner's fault. Why would I blame myself for that? I'm not going to blame him for that. Unbelievable. Trusting my dad is obviously not working. Look at where all our money is gone. I'm really oh, mad right is. now. Why is it bubbling? Because it's old. That's gross. We'll get rid of all of this. No, 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 Nick, I know you're busy. Yeah, I'm fucking shitting myself now. I feel when, you know, things aren't going good, I, I would just assume get out, you know, just move on to the next thing. Yeah, where's Brian? I know you want to run away from it. I, I'm not running away. No, no, I can't run away from it. Yeah, I've just been watching and fucking shitting myself for the last hour. What are you doing to people? Give me an answer! You know, we can't oversee everything. We assume that... OK, know. take me down to the fridge. I want to see how you fucking really work. I cannot believe that this is how you guys are running a restaurant. In my head, I was thinking, we're going to be screwed. That's what in there? That's the walk-in freezer. The freezer. That's the walk-in freezer. Look at the mess here. What's this here? Bacon. Yeah, obviously, bacon smiles. That's from lunch. Yeah. Yeah, five years ago. You leave a spatula in there like that. I'm sorry. Nah, fuck off. I cannot believe what you guys are doing here. There was so much going on. My head was spinning. My head was going to explode. I, I, I thought to myself, this is a disaster. What's that in there? Shit, that didn't get put on. Oh, my god. I don't know what the fuck oh, that's all Oh, fuck that. Oh, my god. Oh, no. This is not good. Raw chicken. That should never happen. You know? should... Oh, my god. God! Chris, it's fucking chicken against raw chicken! It's, it's fucking... Hey, panini head, are you listening to me? Yes. You're gonna kill someone. I've eaten here. Partners, partners in crime. You should be ashamed. We are ashamed. You've just contaminated the town. And Nick, Nick, yeah. stop. Yeah, everybody, right now, this is not a romantic eat out. This is a Valentine fucking massacre. It's a disgrace! How can you do this? I'm closing the place down. Switch it off! This is shocking. When was the last time this was clean inside? My goodness, Nick. Look at that. The floor is caked with grime. 
Oh my god. When was the last time this was Bloody hell. Oh, Christ almighty. What on earth is that? Oh, the smell. You know what you do wrong? You take more, take control. more control of these guys, and I feel that you don't. If you want me to take the control, don't go second guess me about anything that I do. Bad by there. Oh my god. Shit. Look at that there. That is mouse or rat droppings. Oh my god. A couple of hours ago, I was feeling slightly embarrassed for them, slightly concerned in a big way, but now. When a chef let go of his kitchen like this, it proves he doesn't care. I want to be more involved in the business end of things. Forget the business aspect. Well, and your portion is the idea. hosting portion. Hi there. Yeah. Yeah. I was going back to the hotel, couldn't sleep, had a look in the kitchen, and I am absolutely fucking gobsmacked. How can you do that? And when that is? Say that again. What is that? What is that? Come here. Anthony, how can you cook in this? When was the last time this was cleaned? The kitchen? Well, we try to do it on a daily basis, I mean. What? Have you seen under there? Underneath? Underneath here. Joseph, would you mind having a look? I don't think you've actually seen this. Down there. I see it. Look at that. Oh, God. Please. Anthony, talk to me. Give me some form of feedback. Don't bullshit me. Give me something, please. Well, they're asked to do it every day, the staff. They're what? They're asked to do it every day. We're on our ass with half a million dollars debt, and you're telling me now that you don't even clean. Well, that's what we have staff for, right? Oh, my God. What's this, then? What's that on there? The droppings. They're not fucking caraway seeds. I wasn't aware of that. Couldn't imagine it was been that bad. From the surface, everything looks nice and nice. When you start digging, I can't just can't believe it. Isn't this your bedrock? Isn't this where it's all created from? You can't create jack shit from here. I swear to God, I don't think you give a fuck. You should be absolutely ashamed. Chef Ramsey came in like a bat out of hell, and again just whip the living crap out of me. There's only so much you, you could do or say. So why, Anthony? Give me something, please. Oh, my goodness, yeah, I love you. Come up with an answer, Anthony. Although I'm fucking out of here. I swear to God, I am fucking out of here. I can't take much more of this shit. Where do you find that? I found them in the fucking fridge. Smell them. Vic. Look, let me just show you something. What is that? I'm getting nervous now. Talk to me. What is this? That's the fish we're using. That's the fish you're using? Oh, fuck me. Smell that in there. Is this today's fish? No, um, no. The fish, that was really scary because it was smelling bad already. I just couldn't believe it. Where's Patty? Yeah? Have a look at this. Oh, my God. What, look how crispy and curled up it is. Just touch that. Oh, it, it, it's, like, solidified. What's this here? This is tank chip. Why is it all wrapped up in tinfoil? Look at the colour of it. It's oxidised. And what's that in there? It's pieces of pork. That's pork. What have you done to it? Why is it all stuck in there with blood at the bottom of the tray? Why is that? How old is this stuff? Yesterday. Yesterday? He said Friday. Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> When's all this from? Friday. He took it out Friday. Oh. Everything's Friday. Look, let me just show you something. Look how green and slimy it is. That's from Friday. Look. Look at that. That's from Friday. Look at my fingers. Friday? Look. Look. There you go. That's from Friday. How do you say this in Spanish? This is not healthy. No muy saludable. Thank you. What is going on in here? A hungry cat would walk away from that. I was mortified. 
I felt embarrassed for letting this go on for so long. While customers in the dining room continue to eat subpar food, Chef Ramsay's kitchen investigation intensifies. What is going on here? What's that? The burrito. What's that one? The chicken enchiladas. Oh, how? Oh, my God. What's that? That was the ground beef. Ground beef? Half of it's fucking fat, you idiot. It's fatter than you. I felt satisfied that finally somebody called him out on his bullshit. Oh, shit. What's that? The bean. Oh, how? It's like a cement mixer. Are you fucking stupid? Who's controlling this? I am, Chef. You are. You are a walking disaster. Now I'm feeling like, like stupid. Lift it up. The fridge is full of shit. It, it's disgusting. I wasn't here on Saturday, but what were they expecting? Fucking 10,000 customers for lunch? Paddy, I'm fucking disgusted. Yolanda, that's a joke. I understand. I don't want people to get sick, and I don't want them to spread the word that food is bad here. You're overstaffed, underworked, shit food. I wouldn't trust you running a bar, let alone a fucking restaurant. You must be out of your tiny mind. I don't care for your restaurant. I want to take that out there. I dare you, take it out there. Go on, give it to them. Yeah, there you go. It's with me. Look at me. Why wouldn't you take it out there? That's embarrassing. It's embarrassing. Why are you serving it? You don't fucking care. Why? Why? Because you're serving that and trying to charge people money for that. That's why you don't care. I care. For you don't care shit. No fucking way. Fuck. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm so sorry, but we're stopping service. <laughs>